Hello. Hi. Welcome back to a story worth telling. Exciting times. Indeed. Uh, we do gay shit. And today we are... Re- <laughs> I'm not wrong, am I? No, no you're not wrong. wrong. Um, today you we're... told me <laughs> off though last time for summing it up too quickly. And um, we do gay shit. It's a pretty quick summer. Gay shit, yeah. <laughs> Anyway, today we're doing something a bit different. So we are we're doing a movie. We're doing a movie. Uh, we've done movies in the, what? Yeah. Yeah. We we've, <laughs> we've done movies in the past, but we tend to to do like pick out some of the scenes that we like most and just watch those and talk about those. But today we're watching something that we've never seen before. Yeah. And I'm gonna watch. The and whole it has thing. been requested quite a lot. Live. We are saying it. So. If you are watching this on Patreon, you've basically got like two hours of us, so buckle in. Yeah. <laughs> and if you're watching it here on YouTube, then uh, hello. Uh, but also, you know, both parts, we're going to do it in two parts, I think, because it's long. Uh, but both parts are now going to be available on Patreon. So if you want to, if you can't wait, then uh, go check it out on there. Indeed. And before we begin, Oh, I've yes. got some more names to shout out to for such generous donations as we really yeah, appreciate. This is a fucking list. All right, all right, all right. But you're all getting deep a shout breaths, out. Deep breaths. Deep breath. A huge thank you to Lane, Drew, Wibke, Natalie, Antonella, Katrin, Eliza. See, I'm just. You're like, doing well, you're doing well. I'm getting through that. You're doing well. Gerald, Rachel, Chris, Cheryl, Suzanne, Kim, Steve, Jessica, Ryan, Curtis, Lillian, Aurora. Jennifer, Brian, Kyle, Joe, Tim, Tobias, Ingrid, Jody, Vanessa, Francis, David, Alexis, Laura, Manuela, Jane, Craig, Aaron, and Hester. I thought I'd like mix what up the, the speed. Hell? I know, I know, well, I know. Thank you. I mean, that's thank that's a lot all. of people. That is fucking uh, amazing. Yeah. Um. And we, yeah, we're just really yeah. grateful, basically. And all all of that, by the way, is um. People who very kindly donated to our Just Giving page to help us fund some new recording equipment, which will be coming soon. 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 soon, soon, soon. Maybe for Heartstopper? As of recording now, it's still open till Friday, but I don't know when this is going to come out, so it may be closed by then. It'd but closed. we'll put the thing down there anyway. Yeah. Well, it's what it is. It's what it is. Anyway, uh, thank you so much. Yes, We really, thank you. really thank appreciate you. it. Anyway, let's uh, watch a film. A big gay film. A big gay film. Let's watch Bros. Bros. For years I had to suffer as a hot, ripped gay person. Oh god, I know this gay. Are these Clapham gays? These are circuit gays. These are circuit gays. On my head is a hat depicting the Stonewall riots where the queer liberation movement began. Look at all those white little dolls. The award for cis white gay man of the year. Please welcome Bobby Lieber. (laughs) <laughs> this is very... It's ironic. Yeah. I like it. And I am thrilled to announce I have accepted a position as the executive director of the first national LGBTQ plus history museum right here in New York City. I like where this is going. Yeah, I like where this is going. It's, it's, it's suddenly like throwing a bunch of like problematic real life LGBTQ problems and going, wow, well, isn't this ridiculous? And we've all just kind of gone, shit, yeah, yeah, yeah we need yeah, to talk about this now, but in a funny way. Yeah. Ugh. It's setting up all these all these things to knock down, I think. They're all the things yeah. that, like, we'd bring up in conversations yeah. about, yeah. like, criticising representation, yeah. and this is exactly it. So, I like this. Hey, what's up? Back to Grinder. Back to Grinder. <laughs> hey, what's up? Hey, what's up? Oh, my God. Hookups are so awkward. Uh... Bitch says you. That is literally you. No. Yo. I make them let. Yo, what's up, bro? Oh, it's me. That's so you. Oh, That's literally you. I know, it is awkward. Like, right. you just have to get past the first. You're right, yeah, yeah. Hello. Yeah, you wanna... I mean, you're not going to open the door to. Hi, you love! What? <laughs> Paul O'Grady. Let's get down to business. To the beat. 
the horn. <laughs> did you really just ruin <laughs> yes, the line? <laughs> Bored. <laughs> Next. <laughs> <sighs> Do that on a webcam. Why do you need to be in person? Sorry to all sides. What? You're still feeling this kind of post-sex warmth and wistfulness. So I usually walk around for a bit and I kind of coast on that warm feeling. I do that, or used to do that, the post hookup glow. It doesn't look very glowy though. Yeah, but you have this like... Yeah, feelings. And of, you're like, I'm going to the corner of shop. Feelings of joy. Uh, so I totally know this is a little weird and unexpected, but the reason we've been hanging around with Marty so much is that we Apple. are kind of Apple. dating him. Oh. Leave some gays with the rest of us. What? Just very close to home. Sorry, I love your podcast. Can I, can I get a selfie? Oh, sure. He's an influencer. Oh my god, is that us? <laughs> no. Yeah, we did a selfie. I have a very cliched view of what gay men do at a party. <laughs> <laughs> Literally what they do. Cute circuit party. He is reading queer culture yeah, yeah. for filth, and I'm kind of here Every for it. Every single step. There's that guy, Aaron. Oh, okay. Jesus fucking Christ, Aaron. Jesus. Aaron. I mean, he's wearing a hat indoors, so he's an idiot. A hat in a club? Seriously. Seriously, though. I love a hat in a club. No, not in a club. Too hot. Way too hot. It's honestly kind of boring. Hey, what's up? What the fuck? He got that fast. This is Bobby. Do you boys need another drink? I'm getting a shit rocket. What the hell's a shit rocket? It's like a Red Bull, but with protein. Why do I sense he's going to be like, you, what the fuck? I hear you're boring. Who you said that? I'm not boring. I'm very bad at flirting. And I'm also the type of person who tells you I'm flirting, which is so sick. Oh, God, he's you. At least I'm not boring. Uh, planner, basically, I write people's wills. Oh, God. Is it weirder that I find him hotter that he deals with dead people? <clears throat> yes. Oh, I love this song. What is this? Old school Mariah. How do you not know this? I'm more of a country guy. You know, like Garth Brooks. Straight. Yeah, but chest? No. No. I'm just saying, body isn't everything. It's like saying hair isn't everything. Hair isn't everything. Personality is most of it. Yeah, personality is most, most things. I'm half expecting this to turn into like a, he's gonna be the very much like, guys like you don't date guys like me. Because it's already like setting itself up like that. Yeah, of course it's gonna be that. But then also, I don't want him to end up then dating a guy like him. I think you're making assumptions pretty early I know, I know. his character. I'm just, I just, I don't know why I have a problem with- It's a bit like- Main character syndrome making a mockery of itself, but also being that problematic, like, by being... Pity me. Yeah, but by being also gorgeous, six-pack, white, cis men as the love interest. You make a fair point, but he likes country? Ha! <laughs> okay, well, in <laughs> well, that, that case... <laughs> hey, what's up? Hey, where'd you go? I don't know. Nowhere. God, he could fucking smile, couldn't he? Jesus. I don't know. Nowhere. Lies, please. Oh, <laughs> Gay guys are so stupid. Don't look at me. Oh. Okay. <laughs> okay. I would leave. Are it's you like, fucking kidding me? It's like Batman. Have you seen that? Have you seen, <laughs> have you seen that video? Of like, it's the movie Batman, but you see Batman when he's like running out of shot. Just stubborn as you are. Because you know when they always turn around and he's gone. Yeah. 
it just like the camera pans and it's, he's just like finding another car. <laughs> <laughs> so good. And then he ghosts me. He just fucking disappears. Okay. Oh, fuck off. Go, he's a dick. No, I am not letting it go. I do not let things go. Why aren't you dancing? I am dancing, okay? What do you want me to do? The fucking nutcracker suite? <laughs> hey. Hey, what's up? I tried to kiss you and he didn't kiss me back is what's up. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> Goodbye. Hey, wait, wait, take my number. Absolutely not. Why? Because I'm one of the smart ones, asshole. <laughs> Can I see your ass? Don't have ass pick, sorry. I do like a bum pick. No. No? <laughs> Ow! Oh, Jesus! That's not pretty. Oh, I actually did that. This is really what it is yes. like. It's so fucking hard. Oh, he's got a ring light. I mean, ring lights make everything better. I mean, he is like a podcaster, so... Did he block me? Motherfucker! I feel like him sometimes in this community. Mm. It's Aaron. How's Grinder? Ah. A dream. I spent 45 minutes taking a picture of my own ass. How are you? How was group sex with that faux Chicago cub? It was fun. They invited me back tomorrow. Their surrogate is pregnant and they're having a gender reveal orgy. That can't be a thing. No, I'm sorry. And what is it, like, the colour of the condoms is the gender of the child? When do you reveal the gender? At the beginning what, of the what, orgy or the end the of the gender? orgy? What reveals the gender? There's too many questions. Maybe it's the colour of the dildos. Don't need a guide. <laughs> a guide? No. We can go out. Are you asking me out? I'm down for whatever. Yeah, same. Cool. Sounds good. No. Yes. No. Yes. When someone says I'm down for whatever, when you say you're asking Definitely. me out, no, they're not Kelly Rowling you. They are being shit. No, they're just being non-committal. You're very intense. Yes. He's very intense. Mm-hmm. I think he has a bit of social anxiety. What's that about? It's about two closeted gay frontiersmen in the California gold rush of 1849. I never tire of watching two very straight actors really transform themselves into being sad and gay. Gay actors playing gay, that's not even acting. Oh, I totally agree. The irony being they're both gay. Yeah. Wait. They're both gay? Uh-huh. That's gonna be an Instagram follow. <laughs> Happy endings don't win Oscars. Straight people love seeing us miserable. Or dying. Hmm. Josh Evans? Hey, Holy shit! Bro, what is up? Uh, bro! I we played hockey in high school. This is my fiance, Samantha. Hey. Yeah, but I bet you two fooled around in college. Hey. Hey. We just saw the treasure inside. It's about closeted gay frontiersmen. Oh, okay. Nice. Uh, it's just like some dumb movie. Oh, no. No. No, no. I had the biggest crush on him in high school. Yep. That tracks. Well, like the bearded lady in The Greatest Showman, this is me. <laughs> oh. Wow, they are extremely hot. Do you want to go over there? No. Wait, are you ditching me again to go fuck the baseball cosplayer? Wait, is this the end of a date? Oh, I'm not ditching you, I'm inviting you. Yes. No, excuse me. I. Uh, no. Oh my God. I. I actually can't believe how angry I just got from that. <laughs> oh, <laughs> like you go on a date with someone, right? You get to the end and you have the audacity to go. Would Look you like to, to go fuck. fuck these people? If not, I'll go fuck. Like, <laughs> I'm so angry. I'm... <clears throat> Whatever, we should just go over there. It'll be fun. I'm not gonna go, but you should go. Can I ask you one thing though? Why did you text me if you didn't want to hook up? I'm not angry, I'm just honestly curious. I guess I had fun talking to the club and I wanted to say, hey, what's up? Hey, what's up? So basically you texted me when you were feeling hungover and lonely in that moment, but you're not actually into me, but you went on the date anyway. Why are gay guys so weird? Actually, you know, we're not weird. We're just constantly catering to our own whims and needs, which can change on a dime, but we never even think about the emotional consequences of the other person. I mean, he's, he's hitting he's, it right on the head there. And there's something is I mean, to be said. 
when you're dreaming with a broken oh. heart. Okay, I take it back. But <laughs> I'm still the principal. No, because but they're not wrong. It is very much like a no one cares about other people's feelings. Part of it is hurting other people's feelings, but also part of it is de is that's the way we're trying to deal with our own like social issues and problems and anxieties and traumas because of our mm. upbringing. So it's like part and parcel. I get it, but I don't. I never go on dates, but that was really fun. Yeah, I had a really good time too. Is this fake? This is fake. Mm. Oh. What? Oh. Hey, I'm gonna go. Oh, oh really? Yeah. Is everything okay? Is this weird? Oh, no, 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 it's fun. It's great. I just... <laughs> I love this movie. Hey, guys, I'm gonna go. <laughs> no, you're leaving? Yeah, I gotta go. Oh, yeah, it was nice meeting you. Yeah, you too. It was lovely. Thank you. All right. <laughs> Fucking gays, man. Fucking gays. No, I don't take it back. I'm so angry. <laughs> I did not see that coming. That's that such bullshit. Oh, that's so funny. We are so problematic. The worst. We are the worst. This guy I went out with won't stop texting me. A guy? Really? Like a grinder guy? No, shockingly, I actually met this one in real life. We went on one date and we had sex with three people. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I think that's a win. I think, I think no one loses that. No. No one losing. No. Although. No. But I went on. No. Yeah. <laughs> I just realised that. You I'm, are this person. I'm this person. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. How I'm did you? Person. How did that escape your mind? I I just didn't really. I can't. I think I might have blocked it out. But technically, you went on like the date. You know, after. You went on a date afterwards. Yeah. You were texting three people and then went on a date. Well. <laughs> it's more than three people. <laughs> it's, look. The point was is... The, was the date with one of the people in... Yes, in, yes, yes, yes. It wasn't like, you know, someone completely different. Was it like, was it organic? Was it like, do you want to go for coffee after this? Or was it like a... <laughs> yeah. That was the activity. No, I, I actually made dinner and everything. So what do you think? It's pretty incredible. Love this. I'm going to see it. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it's really impressive. But... But it's kind of depressing. It's depressing? It made you depressed? It's AIDS, Nazis, and homophobia. All of it's just it's kind of a downer. No! It's a museum. It's not supposed to be fun. I do like what he's saying, though. Mm. Like, this one was really good at, like, bringing you in the educational elements as well. But, like, the idea of also making them, like... Make it fun. Yeah. We should know about all the educational elements, all the history. Mm. Ontario. But maybe we should look at it in more of a bring it to life instead of putting it behind Just a lot of pictures. Yeah. I almost forgot to tell you. Do you remember Josh Evans? Yeah, Josh Evans from high school. I actually ran into him and his fiance on the street the other day. Well, they just broke up. And you want to know why? He's gay. Because he's gay. Oh, it's a spanner in the works. I've been empowered by my hero, Colton Underwood. To say that, as it turns out, I'm gay. And like this post if you like that I'm gay. Peace. Sorry, no. Like <laughs> this post if you like that I'm gay. It's a bit of a shameless plug, but... Tell you what, like this video. It's a disgusting... Like this video if you yeah. like that we're gay. Like this video <laughs> if you like how gay we are. Not that gay. <laughs> no, but seriously like it. <laughs> <laughs> Don't keep texting him. Don't ring him. No, no one does that. I think persistence is cute. You want to hang out this weekend? Hey, Bobby. I have to be honest. I really like hanging out with you. You're so smart and funny, but I'm not sure I'm the right match for you. Oh, come on. Don't leave him on red, girl. Just say, you know what? Yes. Yes, I will. Sure. Yes. 
No! Well, he's kind of lying to himself a little bit. Crazy story. Remember that guy I ran into, that old buddy from high school? Yeah. Yeah. He just came out. What? Broke up with his fiance. I had no idea. Wow. Crazy. Jamie absolutely hates these sunglasses. Yeah, but we also have a friend who absolutely loves those sunglasses. Well, so let us know. Look, everyone makes their choices. Boot or toot? The sunglasses. Wait, which one's bad? A boot. I don't think so. Gay things. Oh my god, you're literally him. You're not attracted to me, right? It's okay. I can handle it. I won't be insulted. I just need to know. Just be honest with me so I don't waste my time. This is too much. Way too much. They are like a little bit fire and f fire. <laughs> you want to play with the big boys, yeah. huh? Oh, look, Aaron, they're fighting. You want to be in the... I mean, I'd quite like to play with the big boys. Uh, yeah, you like that? Hey. Yeah, I can be tough. Oh, wow. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Someone's going to get hurt. Oh, yeah, hey! What's going oh, on? Oh, oh, yeah. Boys? Oh. Okay, man. <laughs> My place is near here. Let's go the fuck. Oh no. No. Yes? No, come on. No, this is silly. Look, I am all for kinks that. Oh no. Cute. No, he needs to go in the burn. Oh, straight in the burn. They're like chimps. Jesus! Oh yeah, you're gonna tap out? Yeah, yeah, I'll tap yeah. out! Oh, yeah. I'll tap out! What is going on? I tapped out! Are you good? Are you good? I tapped out! Okay, I'm sorry. I tapped out. Do we need a safe word? Yes! Is that the safe word? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Is that the first time you've ever seen poppers on a in a movie ever? Um, oh, I don't know actually. Maybe. Might have seen it in It's a Sin. Yeah, maybe. No. I don't know. No, because that was set a while ago, right? They had poppers in the eighties. Did they? I think. Well, I don't know. Anyone know? Anyone know? Poppers in the eighties. I think you do see poppers, but I think the problem with poppers is that they're often like not shown in necessarily a positive light. Uh, uh. Oh, but he's a soft lover. No, he looks like a shit lover. Yeah, he does look shit, actually. Well, I guess that was that. God, I never thought I would date someone who gets more excited about Austin Bowers than Deborah Messing. Where did I go wrong? Wait, are we dating? You absolutely, you went on a date. You're dating. Ow, what are you doing? <laughs> I think they're dating. I think that's dating. A warm body feels laying on another warm body. Nice warm body. Bobby, I need to tell you something. When I was younger, What happened? Well, what had happened was... When I was younger, I wanted to make little chocolates. Oh, well, it's good time dreams. What was I going to do with that, though? What was I going to be? A chocolatier? Bobby, I wasn't going to be a fucking chocolatier. I don't know. Why not? It seemed kind of faggy. Mm-mm. I'm sorry. This is the cutest thing I've ever heard. This is the cutest thing I've ever heard. But he is seriously troubled. This is like a metaphor, I think. I mean, I love chocolates, so I must be the biggest fag there is. I don't understand. You don't have to be stuck in that miserable office all day. You could be out in the world, I don't know, making fudge, you know? Fudge backer. Josh, you... Well, yes. yes. <laughs> I have to drag my concave chest up to Provincetown and beg donors for money. I need five million dollars or else the museum can't open. Hey, maybe I can come. Okay. To where? Provincetown? I want to go to Provincetown. It's apparently so gay. Really? Gayest place in America. Provincetown? Yeah.